introduction to organic chemistry on the basis of source compounds are classified into two types these are organic compound and inorganic compounds the compound which are obtained from non living sources are called inorganic compound as for example sulfuric acid calcium sulfate sodium chloride calcium oxide these are obtained from minerals or can be prepared in laboratory by using non living materials organic compound the compound which are obtained from living sources are called organic compounds these are obtained from plant and animals or living sources example carbohydrates proteins lipids berzelius in 1808 gave the theory vital force theory the compound which are obtained from living sources only are called organic compound or berzelius defined organic compound as a the compound which are obtained from living organism are called organic compound example sucrose obtained from fruits and from nectar of plant like sugar cane protein obtained from animals lipids obtained from animals friedrich oehler break down the vital force theory he prepared organic compound by using non living chemicals or inorganic chemicals he prepared by using ammonium cyanate urea it is first organic compound synthesized in laboratory hence german chemist friedrich oehler is considered as the father of organic chemistry and we can define organic compound as a any chemical compound which are made up of carbon and hydrogen or carbon carbon bonds are called organic compounds it is also known as hydrocarbon and organic chemistry is a branch of chemistry that studies the structure properties and reactions of hydrocarbon and its derivatives most organic compound contains carbon and hydrogen but they also include any number of other elements example nitrogen oxygen halogens phosphorus silicon sulfur called guest elements